a welcome back. It doesn't matter how big or small or how much land you have, you can still farm where you live. And this group wants to show us how you can do that with a really cool event. We have Josh and Megan Fisher with us to tell us more about the Farm Where You Live event. Good to see you both. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. So what does that mean, farm where you live? <laughs> so when you hear the word farm, everyone has a picture in their head where you're thinking maybe 300 acres of right. cornfields and cows. <laughs> and we don't have that. The average person doesn't have that. But um, you can go to your local feed and seed store and get seeds and maybe buy some chickens and do it in your own backyard. And with inflation the way it is, a lot of people are really into growing their own food, foraging, doing all of that. Yes. So you can save some money and also you, I think you respect a bit more about food when you do buy it. You, you respect where it comes from and the Absolutely. people that grow it. So How much land do y'all have personally? I'm just curious. Just under two acres. So. That's all right, but, but what do you farm? You have chickens? You do? Yeah. We're looking so at some video right now. Look at this. Yeah, okay. that's, that's our very own chickens right there. Um, <laughs> That's not our. That's not our property. Okay. That's where the event's going to be. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we've got some chickens, and then we've got um, two pigs, and then we've got some bunnies. The bunnies are just kind of recreational. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then a garden What's the event coming up? This sounds really interesting. We've got an event Saturday at the Music Camp in Spartanburg, which is very upstate Spartanburg. Yeah. And uh, we're going to have Joel Salatin, his uh, the lunatic farmer. He's uh, he's coming down from Virginia to speak. He's internationally known written a ton of books was actually on food inc uh that's where we we found him but he's going to be he's going to be there doing a morning and afternoon seminar and selling seated tickets for that too so awesome and i think this stuff is just really fascinating like i'm just now starting to get into foraging mushrooms which is something that i'm interested sure. in yeah but a, a lot of people you don't have to have an interest in, in something specific you can really just come there and listen to people talk about about this maybe make some new connections about something that you're working on as well so that's, that's really right. what yeah. we're passionate about we want to build the community around it josh and i laugh all the time because we learn the hard way a lot of the things you know we <laughs> we, we, we kind of just jumped into it we're not we don't come from a family of farmers so it's true if you plant razor blades and cabbage seeds you grow cold slaw uh, that's exactly right that's yeah exactly right so you crack the secret exactly the location of the Music it, real it's Childress Road in Spartanburg. We actually have all the information on our website. Okay. It's farmwhereyoulive.com. Right. Mm -hmm. So we mentioned the, the one speaker there. There are going to be different types of vendors set up where people can interact with them as well. We have a ton of local vendors. We have actually classes going to be happening all day that's included in the ticket price. Mm -hmm. Ticket price is $5 online right now, and it's going to end at midnight, and we're going to sell $10 tickets at the gate. Still really inexpensive yep. for the amount of information and knowledge you guys are going to be giving out to folks. Yeah, you exactly. Petting, petting zoo? We also have a petting zoo. It's going to be hard to keep Josh from taking that's all right. the animals <laughs> home with him. Well, the bunnies so. there, your bunnies? Not our bunnies, but they are going to have a bunch of farm animals. It's um, <laughs> It's going to be very kid-friendly, family-friendly. We're going to have some other things for kids' activities. What are you guys growing right now? Are some of the things that you guys oh, are really A lot of corn right now to, corn. to feed our animals. Yeah. Just like you're talking about, uh, everything's expensive right now. It so is. It's, it's pretty simple. I mean, it just takes imagination and hard work to have a successful homestead. Yes. Yeah. So if you're interested in homesteading, this is the time and the event in the upstate to check it out to get your stuff started. Farmwhereyoulive.com. You can get those tickets for five dollars online right now and of course ten dollars at the gate if you wait after midnight to get those done but buy them and now free under ten free That's under right. ten okay. yeah awesome thank you guys best of luck with all your your farming and everything anytime you want to get rid of some corn or some okra or some tomatoes you know <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll bring them we'll back <laughs> we'll, we'll trade though for some mushrooms okay yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. there you go a little bit